we are on our hike so we we came here look and no one is here so the weather is so bad i was hoping the weather's gonna be better this is nature actually you know it just it, it just happens like there's just a one van we're gonna park here for a while and maybe just pray stay uh, we came for a hike in mount cook although the weather forecast was rain but i i didn't listen to it i was like it's gonna be uh sunny and um we left aerotown like around five this morning and now it is like almost 10 and it is, it is still raining and we are out alone we there is no one i think there's one van that we just saw and actually we we are we are in no rush we don't have to uh, go back that's why we are just sitting in a car and i feel like recording this video because it is so funny that um, whenever we plan a trip, we are always like rushing, we need to go here and we always feel like, oh, it's just a, it's a holiday, so we must try to achieve everything. And uh, we used to be the same, we are always like, oh, let's do this um, after this. And we never enjoyed it. And now we are inside this car, we are, we are like a new, brand new people, we are just we are just lying down and watching the rain, enjoying the, the, the sound of the rain in our car roof. Um, it's also thunderstorm and lightning, which I'm not really a fan of, but um, nature, is, nature is good. Nature is so, it doesn't have, it has to be there to impress us. Um, these people drove all the way, like four hours to reach here and I, I, I don't have to be like pretty for them. It is so authentic. It, it has its own way, its own nature. Like it doesn't have to shine for us. It can do its own way. And um, all my life, I can relate to it nature because all my life I have tried to be uh, someone that I'm not. I always try to like have people pleasing, try to impress people and um, went out of my comfort zone just to make someone happy when it literally drained out my energy and um, smiling too much even I don't want to smile and and uh, it's just I think another way of nature saying me to slow down just just enjoy enjoy your coffee lie down on your comfortable car and just be there and um, yeah it, it is so it's not forcing nature is it's, it knows how beautiful it is if it is to shine now, the mountains are covered in snow. They are so pretty. I have some pictures from um, last year. Uh, maybe um, I'll post it later. It knows that how beautiful it is, but it doesn't try to shine for anyone. And I think it's so important for us to realize that it is, it is a simple talk for me, but when you talk it from your inner core or in your vortex, if you, if you, try to know it from there you'll understand sometimes we we do so much of affirmation like i'm beautiful i'm happy but if you don't feel it from your strong core that is a lie and and that will that will be like a opposite you're fighting against your true nature but if you are genuinely happy from the inner core it feels so freaking good to say that i'm so happy doing nothing here um, I'm in such a calm state. I'm like, um, I have nothing to worry. I'm in like a, I'm, I'm just enjoying this sound. I hope you guys can hear me. And um, yeah, I think life is, life is so beautiful. Life is so freaking beautiful. And we, we forget to appreciate little things. And I, I, there, like this kind of moment, of course, came in our life before when we used to go in Raglan in North Island to go everywhere. But oh, it's rain! Oh, let's run away from the rain, and we never enjoy it. And looking at the nature, and I think it's so important to be authentic. It is so important. The whole life I've tried to impress someone. Um, I have like millions of stories to share, but yeah, yeah, I, I was always fighting against my true nature, and it didn't serve me in good way. But then I learned, I learned from it and everyone I think learned in their own time and in their, with their own life experiences. 
so for the rest of the day we're just gonna be here and um, go home or just have nice lunch and um, sleep. Mm -hmm.